Hi, Coach Jay with Ray Fitness and Body Works here for the part three of your video on how to get rid of your lower back pain fast. But of course, before we move on, if you like this video, like and share it to your friends and family because they may have the same issue just like you do. Okay, so after you are done putting cold compression on your tender muscle or warm compression on your tight muscle, it's time to stretch them. I am going to give you five moves on how to stretch your lower back so you can relieve those pain immediately. Okay, let's start. So we're going to need a slider today or simply you can use a paper plate to help you assist you slide forward and backward. Okay, so keep your feet a little bit hip width apart, slightly bend your knees. Good. Now the slower the move, the better. Sit up tall, make sure that you're not hyperextending backward, okay? Sit up tall, do not load your lower back. Engage your core, now slowly push forward and back up. Nice one, again, the slower the move, the better. Good, give me two more, perfect. Next one, I need you to hold it on the third move. Hold it for five to seven seconds, good. Now you can ex uh, mm, extend your legs and Increase your range of motion. Bring it up. So release it slowly. So it just depends on your range of motion. You can always extend all the way further, but keep your lower back round or the C curve, as we call it. Belly button towards your spine. Good. Perfect. Next one. Feet a little bit wider than your hips this time, and we're gonna slide one side. Same thing. So this one, you will be able to determine which side is needed more stretching. And just sit, hold, five to seven seconds, and then switch on the other side. Okay, so same thing. Round your back, make sure you're feeling those lower back and you're not flexing from the hips. So pretty much you're flexing, bending from your waistline. Okay, down, hold it for five to seven seconds. Good one. Okay, next move, we're gonna need to move your knees, okay? Bend your knees here, then bend an opposite. Knee to elbow, opposite, we're gonna stretch it down and back up. Same thing, slowly. Two times, and the third one, you have to hold it five to seven seconds and really Allowing the muscle to naturally stretch. Again, do not force it. Good. All right, you can do this two or three times, okay? Then switch on the other side. So same thing. Okay, opposite elbow knee. Hold here. Good. One more. And on the third one, you have to really work on your end point here and slowly Stretch, allowing the muscle to Good one. Woo. All right, next one, we're gonna go down on the floor this time. Belly button towards your spine, tilt the hip a little bit. Get, separate your feet a little bit wider than your uh, hip, and then drop those knees sideways, slowly, and then switch. Good. Now work again, work on your own fitness level or flexibility level, go as far as you can go only. So you're gonna feel your end point. So stretch it and hold it for five to seven seconds. Again, do not force it. And just feel those stretch. Perfect, okay, good. And the last one, of course, is the cross. Get, okay. let's do it on the other side. Okay, up here, that way you see it more. Keep this opposite arm flat on the floor and slowly stretch it. Now this one, you're gonna feel your IT band, your piriformis muscle, all the way to your glutes, and of course your lower back. Good, and then switch. Good one. And release, all right, and slowly up. Good, all right, and that's how you stretch your lower back. So, if you like this video, don't be a silent follower. Like or love it and share it to your friends and family. And also message me if you have more questions. Watch out for our last video on how to strengthen those lower back. See you next time!